you make of the Rovers side that you played against last Thursday um, and the main threats that they will pose to you this coming Thursday? Very well organised, very well drilled. Uh, I'd expect nothing less from a Jose Mourinho team. Um, yeah, dangerous side. They showed that they, they can be clinical. Uh, I think they uh, they played the game how they wanted to play it. Um, I think they were they were probably happy to get away with the draw, so they could they could take it home and and, and decide it uh, at their stadium. So um, yeah, very organised team, uh, a team that's that's going to be dangerous. Um, and uh, yeah, to be honest, our focus is more on us than than the opposition. I think that's how we approach every game. Um, so it's all about how we kind of impose our style of football on them. Uh, what wins big semi-finals like this, big matches and the big occasions? Goals. Is, is there an attitude that you need? Um, yeah, I mean, it's the same as every single football game. It, it's no different in terms of, of the occasion you have to play the game. Um, we're up against the quality quality side at home in, a, in, in an iconic stadium but all of that has to disappear for us and, and we have to focus on the game and um, I think the way we played uh, in the last leg gives us confidence and uh, it shows us that we can control these games but uh, we obviously need to, to, to be ruthless, we need to tighten up in those moments uh, like the, the, they have two chances and they score one of them um, and we have to eliminate that and we have to be clinical when we get ours. Is this an occasion that you can try and enjoy? Because it's a young team, isn't it, going to, as you mentioned, an incredible place to go and play football. Is the message to the whole squad that you have to be professional, straight down the line, not focus, and not try and enjoy the occasion? No, you only enjoy the occasion if you win. Um, and, and it's as simple as that. The message is to win. And um, then the enjoyment comes naturally after that. Um, I think it's easier for, for someone of, of my age to kind of take stock and, and, and see how far the club has come, that we, we are in a position like this, but I think the focus has to, has to just be on winning. How much do you learn as a player playing in these sorts of matches? How much better do you get quickly playing in massive semi-finals in incredible atmospheres like this? I don't know how... Uh, how you get better quickly I don't think that's that's possible it all it all kind of gets stored in the bank of, of experience um, this is great experience for for so many players and and these are the type of moments that you you, you can look back on one day and, and draw on them when you need uh, when you need them and um, yeah it, it all contributes to the mentality that you build and uh, the mentality that we're looking to build is a winning mentality and, and being in these situations and getting to finals where, you know, where everything is on the line. And uh, when you do get to those finals, when you've been there before, then you can draw upon those experiences. What, is it, what does it say about this competition that the last four teams that left in it are yourselves, Roma, Marseille and, and, and Fionnier, four, four really big clubs there? Yeah, definitely. Um, I'm not sure that they expected the clubs of that size to be uh, to be in this competition, uh, but you know it, it just provides great opportunity for all of us to uh, to go and and play in a in a European final. Um, so uh, I think it's great for the competition. I think it's great for the clubs involved, uh, for the fans. Um, you know, it's it's another away trip that that we can uh, that we can experience together. So. Uh, so yeah, it's uh, yeah, it's something that's very welcome, I think. And obviously, it's not going to rank anywhere, you know, near the Premier League or FA Cup. But where where can you put it on that list of things that that you've achieved in your career? Should you go all the way? That's not an obvious. It's a European trophy. Um, so every trophy is important. Every uh, every competition that you can win is important. Um, I've said this numerous times. I don't play football to to finish fourth or fifth or sixth you, you 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 do it for the the occasions where you're in finals regardless of what competition it is it's about winning it's about winning trophies those are the those are the moments that fans will look back on those are the moments yourself as a player one day when you retire will look back on is those moments when you when you got to lift trophies